guys, what's up? For my first video of 2015, I'm going to share with you some tips on how to start writing a diary and how to hide it safely. Let's start! Number 1. Get a diary that will make you feel excited to write in it. I suggest getting something that suits your taste. I usually just use a regular black covered notebook, but this year, I decided to use something fancier for a change. You can use whatever book you like as long as it makes you feel ecstatic to start filling it in. Use a regular pen to write in your diary. Learn from my mistake and don't use something like markers or gel pens because if you happen to spill some water on your diary, your writing will get smudged and ruined. Don't use pencil either because it can get erased and your writing will most likely diminish in time. Always strike the current date at the top of every page. You want to know about the time of which the events in your diary took place when you read it later on. Give your diary a name. This one is optional but it will be fun to give a nickname to your diary so it will feel as if you're pouring your feelings out to someone else instead of to an unanimated object. When I was in middle school, I used to call my diary Ruka which was the name of an anime character I loved back then. Write down anything you want to write. Don't limit yourself. Your diary is your sanctuary. If nothing interesting happens to you today, then write down your thoughts, your feelings, interests, stories, poetry, or even song lyrics that cross your mind at that time. Everything you put down there, no matter how trivial it is, will be meaningful and entertaining for you when you read it later on in the future. Feel free to fill your diary with drawings, pictures, and other things that correspond to the events that happened to you that day such as movie tickets, bills, candy wrappers, etc. The next one is the most important point. If you forget to write in your diary for days, then just start writing again from the current day. Don't worry about skipping days or even weeks. If you try to catch up with all past events, you'll most likely lose interest in writing your diary. Just remember to write down what you haven't been writing regularly so that your future self will understand about the reason behind the time skip. Now that you've managed to start writing your diary, it's time to hide it safely. Here are some places you can try. In your pillowcase, underneath your mattress, in your handbag or purse or old backpack, among your other books, disguise it with a fake cover and put it among your other books, behind your TV or computer, under a pile of stuffed animals, in your underwear drawer, inside your blanket, or behind the back of a picture and a wall. Of course, there are countless hiding spots that you can use, but those were just some of my personal favorites. So, those were all the tips I could share with you guys. I hope they helped you in some ways. I personally got the inspiration to start writing my diary again from reading this Emily the Strange graphic novel. This is actually Emily's diary. She puts a lot of things in her diary, including her drawings and photographs. This is one of my favorite fiction books of all time. If you like Emily the Strange, then you should definitely check the book out. Okay then guys, thank you very much for watching this video and thank you for those of you who have subscribed to me. If you haven't, then please don't forget to click on the shiny subscribe button somewhere down below. Also, I apologize for not uploading a video last week. I was busy doing my thesis and my other college projects, so I didn't really have the time to film any video. Even if I did try filming one, my friends would probably kill me for that. But anyway, I hope I'll be able to start uploading more frequently than before starting from now on. Like always, feel free to let me know if you want me to make a certain type of video that you would like to watch so I'll know what you want to watch, what am I talking about? That's all for today then, I'll see you guys on the next video, have a nice day everyone, bye bye!